everyone and happy Friday. Thank you for coming to my channel and clicking on my video. I appreciate you. Today I am going to make orange chicken. Now this is the first time I have ever done this recipe. I've never made it before. Um, I found the uh, recipe on Pinterest. Uh, I will link it down below in the description so you can check it out. So let's get started and let me show you what you're gonna need. Okay, and here's what you are going to need. Um, you're going to need, I think the recipe calls for three um, chicken breasts just cut up into um, little bite-sized pieces. I just have some um, thin breast uh, fillets, so I'm gonna chop those up. So you need chicken and you need two eggs and you're just gonna beat those up and put them in a bowl. And you're gonna need one cup of barbecue sauce. I think in the recipe um, they have sweet baby rays, but this is what I have. So you're going to need barbecue sauce and just one cup of that. And then you are going to need one cup of the orange marmalade. You're gonna need two tablespoons of soy sauce. And um, that's just a little bit of oil that you're gonna put in your pan when you put the chicken in. And then you're gonna need a cup of flour and a cup of cornstarch. So that's what this is and it's just all mixed up. But that is it. This is all you need for this recipe. Okay, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is get you a pot and put it on low because you're just gonna want this to simmer. You need one cup of your barbecue sauce. Then you are going to need one cup of your marmalade, your two tablespoons of soy sauce. And I'm just using reduced sodium, but you don't have to. You can use whatever you want. Okay, and that's it. We're gonna give it a stir. And you just wanna put it on low because you just want it to simmer. So it can do its thing while you're over here cutting your chicken and getting that ready. Okay, now I'm done cutting up all my chicken, as you can see here. And I've just got it cut into little bite-sized pieces. And I've got my pan right here. Um, I've got it on three right now. It's getting hot. You want it to get hot before you put your chicken in. But the first thing you're gonna wanna do is just get some of your chicken pieces and just put them right into your egg. Just like that. Okay, now once you've got them in the egg, you're going to take them out and you are going to put them in your flour and your cornstarch mixture. It's going to plop it right in there. Okay, now once you got it in your cornstarch and your flour, you're just going to coat it. Make sure you coat it real good. Okay, we're going to shake it like this. Shake, shake, shake. Good enough. And then we're just gonna put it over here on the plate, just like that. Ta-da! Now I've got all my chicken dipped in the egg and in the flour. I got it right here. And that was a little messy to do. So, and I made a mess, but I cleaned it all up. So just to let you know, it's gonna be, unless you can figure out a way to do it without being so messy, but I'm like a really messy cook. So put it on at least medium high. I think it already is hot actually. And so here's my oil. I'm gonna put that in there. And I'm not gonna put all this in at once, no way. I'm just gonna put in a little bit at a time to cook it. A Little bit more oil. Okay, and I just put some of my chicken in the pan here. And I didn't wanna to put too much. I didn't wanna overcrowd it, but it's nice and hot and sizzling away. And I'm gonna go ahead and get all this cooked. And after I get Sorry about that. After I get the chicken all cooked, I'm just gonna set it here on the plate before we get it into this yummy sauce. And then here is the sauce. Look at that, it's just been simmering very slowly over low heat. Just getting ready for this. I just did these into little bite-sized pieces. Hey, I'm just waiting for this, and as soon as it's done, it's about to be some orange chicken. 
Okay, now this chicken is done. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off, and I had to put my apron on because I already ruined my new t-shirt. I got oil stains on it. Like, it doesn't take me long to ruin a shirt at all. That is why I never buy expensive shirts. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is, I have my plate of chicken back here, but I don't have enough room on it for this. So I'm just going to get a bowl and pour the rest in there. And then I'm gonna put the rest of the chicken in here with it. So let me do that. Here it is. Okay, let's get that in there. Ta-da! And then what I'm going to do is just get the sauce and pour it into the bowl and mix it. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Okay, here's our chicken. Now let's get our sauce in there. Smells good. Let's pour it all in there. Yummy, 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 yummy. Yum, yum, yum. Hey, let's get it mixed up. Oh, this is gonna be good. The chicken's gonna be a little crunchy. And then you're gonna have the sweet sauce. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, goodness, this smells good. Y'all, look at this. Doesn't that look like something you'd find in the restaurant? Look at that. Yummy, I'm excited. I'm glad I tried this recipe. There is also a version of this where you do it in your crock pot. Like you go ahead and you um, cook the chicken pieces and everything and put them in your crock pot and then pour the sauce over and give it a stir and just let it um, cook in there all day. But I wanted to do mine on my stove. Ooh, look at that. Oh, I'm excited. Look at this. Look at that. Yummy, yum. Oh, this is gonna be good over some rice. All right, let's get it plated up. Okay, y'all, here comes my favorite part. Time for a little taste test. It smells good, and as you can see, I just have it sitting on some rice. Yum, 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 yum. And I thought I'd sit down so I could get a better um, lighting. Ooh, ooh, it's hot. It is hot, it is hot. Oh, and the chicken's crispy. Got a blow on it. Good. Sweet. You don't really taste the barbecue all that much. Mmm, good. Mmm, mmm. I think I want to put a little bit more soy sauce on mine. I made a mess. Thank goodness I have on my apron, y'all. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to wear my shirt again because I ruined it. Typical me, it's what I do. Ruin clothes, that's why I would don't, that's why I don't buy expensive clothes. Okay, let's try this. Get some rice. Mmm, mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Putting more soy sauce on there is good. Mm. This is good. The only thing I think I might do different next time is not put in a whole cup of the orange marmalade. Mm, really good. Put you some soy sauce on top. Mm, mm, mm. Y'all don't need to go order takeout. You can have it right here. Looky there. Mm. And you know you can make any other kind of sauce you wanted instead of the... Um, the orange sauce. You could do any kind of sauce and put your chicken in. So, yes. Ooh, and the rice with the sauce on it. Yep. You can cook some egg rolls and serve with this. Y'all, I hope you go make this. It's delicious. Don't go order takeout. Go ahead and make your own. I promise you will not regret it. I hope you enjoyed this video. That's the end of my video, everyone. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you go and make this. Don't go order takeout. You've got it at home. You can do this. If I can do it, you can do it. I promise you. It's delicious. Thank you for coming to my channel and watching this video. 
don't forget to leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think. Let me know if you're going to make this or not. I hope you do. I hope you have a good weekend. I hope you have a safe weekend and I'll see you Monday. Bye.